Naturally Rounded here. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. Stay a while. Subscribe. Check out some of my other content. If you're one of my old-time subbies, welcome back. I love you. Thank you so much for watching my videos. I've started a new series on my channel that's basically my natural hair how-tos. It's a series of videos on how I do different things with my natural hair. For example, my last how-to video was how I slick back my natural hair. If you have not seen that video yet, I will leave a link to that video down below in the description box as well as up above in the cards. So I am about to work out. And as you can see from the title of this video, I will be showing you how I wear my hair while I work out or I guess how I style my hair, how I work out. Either way, I don't know what I'm gonna title this video yet, but y'all get what I'm saying. So let's just get right into it before I lose my <laughs> motivation and enthusiasm to actually work out. Two things that you will need. First, a knee high, just a regular old knee high, nothing fancy, and a thick scrunchie. This is a fresh wash and go. If you would like to see how I achieve this style, I will also leave that video down below in the description box as well as the cards up above. So first things first, I just take the knee high and I'm gonna flip my hair over to pull it up to the top of my head as much as possible. I put the knee high up here, so. Bring it around the back. and then pull the strings from either side. Then I cross this again over in the front. So underneath the ponytail, I cross it, and then just leave these here, that's fine. Okay, so this is what you have here. You see the knee high is over here, securing my hair in this ponytail. Now when my hair was shorter, this is all I had to do and I could work out like this. But as you can see, this is all down in my face. I would be sweating and it would be in the way. So as best as you can, take your hair, twist it. And some of you might have already figured out what we're gonna do. If not, you will see in just a moment, I'm going to put this in a bun. You take your thick scrunchie, and this doesn't have to be a cute bun. We're working out, so. Ain't nobody getting chose in the gym. Well, you might be, so if you do, hey. And then I just bring it over, which secured the bun, and I'm able to work out. You see? This is good enough. It's not the cutest thing. And I'm not really concerned about that because I'm going to get sweaty anyways. I'm going to work out. The thing that I'm the most concerned about is, is the hair off of my neck, off of my back, and off of my face. It is. Check, check, check. So I'm good to go. Now, I've also done my hair like this just when I wanted to do a bun style. And then, of course, I would be more intentional about the shape of my bun. Like, this is lopsided. And you know, if you wanna slick back your edges, that's all your prerogative. Now, I work out from home, so that might just be easier said for me because I'm not seeing anybody else while I work out. But if you do work out at the gym, then by all means, you know, be a little neater with it, slick your edges down if you want to, if that will last through your workout. There's also the option of putting a scarf over this. If you do the bun, hair secured, but you just don't feel comfortable with your hair being like this when you go out, or you're not comfortable with just putting your head down on the mats at the gym or whatever, then definitely just tie a scarf around. You could either just do around your hairline for a smaller scarf, or you could take a big satin scarf and cover the whole thing. And it would just be a cute little 
turban look. So that's about it for this quick natural hair how-to video. If you have any suggestions for how-to videos that you would like to see me do, then please drop them down below in the comments section. I already plan to film how I sleep with my natural hair, how I wet plop my natural hair, how I detangle my natural hair. Again, if you have any suggestions, requests, whatever, of how-to videos that you would like to see me do, just drop them down below in the comment section. Now, this is the moment in the video where I like to point your attention to some of my other content, like my other how-to video and another one of my natural hair videos that you might enjoy. If you haven't seen either of those videos, please check them out. I love you for watching. Y'all please be safe out there and I'll see you in the next one.